Former Ravens wide receiver Torrey Smith, his wife Chanel, they are stepping up in a huge way by helping revitalize a Baltimore rec center that was once a staple in the community. And Sean Stryker is live tonight in West Baltimore. This is a big deal for that area, isn't it, Sean? Yeah, Rick and De Denise, it really is. The Hilton Rec Center closed in 2008, and it was an asset to this community. It provided a meeting space where you can see some kids over there using the basketball court. But thanks to Tori and Chanel, it will soon breathe new life as they provide programming and staffing to reopen this center. After helping bring a Super Bowl to Baltimore, former Ravens wide receiver Tori Smith and his wife Chanel are looking to bring even more to the city. Yeah, Tori and I became adults in this city, and we grew to love the community and the people in it, and we really believe that there's so much potential here in Baltimore. With their nonprofit Level 82 already offering after school programs, they were looking for something that impacted the entire community, so they teamed up with Baltimore City Recreation and Parks. So we literally were going around the city. Different locations, different neighborhoods, trying to find where the need was and to find out where we could fit in. They would land on the currently closed Hilton Recreation Center in West Baltimore. And we know the potential that exists, so you know we're looking forward to that responsibility of helping others. Once a home to youth sports and summer camps, the rec center now sits empty. When I look at this facility, I see nothing but potential. Reginald Moore is the executive director of the Recreation and Parks Department. It's an opportunity for us to reimagine the space. It's a safe haven for our, our youth, but it's also an opportunity for our seniors in the morning to come out and have some programming opportunities. With a vision of bringing mentorship opportunities, athletics, as well as after school arts and STEM programs to the center, they're also seeking the community's input. We want them to tell us what they want done so we can make sure that we're meeting their needs. All to help a community that they have grown to love reach its full potential. Now, because of the pandemic, they don't know exactly when this rec center will reopen. Rick and Denise, they are doing something really cool on Tuesday of next week. They will be giving out free hot Thanksgiving meals to the community. That's starting 5 p.m. right here at the Hilton Rec Center. Reporting in West Baltimore, Sean Stryker for WJZ.